Hi everybody and Hello. welcome to today's video. So we have got something to unbox and show you. Yay. We have got a vacuum. We do. We've been sent one to review. Yeah, it's our first vacuum unboxing and review. Hey! <laughs> Maybe this could lead to a new career. Who knows? <laughs> In things that suck. Anyway, <laughs> so we have a Jimmy. A Jimmy JV35. Yeah, Jimmy JV35. And it's an anti mite vacuum cleaner. <laughs> and this we are very excited about because we have pets. We do. And as you know, pets can get mites. Yes. I mean, we, we literally, we, we do put flea and mite things on our cats, but you never know, no. especially in the area we live in, things can come in, we've got big bifold doors right in front of us. It's best to make sure that everything's picked up. So I'm gonna angle the camera down and we're gonna get unboxing. Right, so we may have some, a little feline helper. This is Bo. <laughs> Uh, we actually have three cats, if you don't know, if you're just watching um, for our vacuum unboxing. Two of them molt like crazy. Yeah. Well. So by the way, this product is available on Amazon. We will leave it linked in the description box below. But this is what you get when you sort of unbox. Ooh, ooh that box broke away quite satisfyingly, didn't it? There we go, let's remove that one then. So, um, this is what you get. You have a picture of the gym. You know, it is a handheld device, so I think it does literally look that kind of small. Um, is there anything on the on the box? Okay, let's read out some features. So, we have multiple noise reduction structure, low working noise, which is always good. Professional UVC light removes dust mite and allergy efficiently. Switch different working modes with a single press of a button. Mm. So it is the model JV35, input 220 volts uh, to 240 volts, which is 50 hertz. And the net gross weight is 2.6 kilograms, which is 3.7 kgs. The color, blue, I think that is. And obviously quantity one, rated power 700 watt. There we go. Its manufacturer is King Clean Electric Co. Shall we get unboxing? Yes. Okay. Do you want to do the honours? I will. I will. <laughs> Matt will do the honours. Okay. There we go. Ooh. Okay. So, immediately you can see that there is a kind of a handbook. Um, maybe you could have a look in the handbook and see what's there. Uh, now. We have a little cellophane uh, wrapper, I think. This looks like a filter. So the filter, oh, it's like a silicone. I'm not sure if you can see, but that's like a silicone with, with the filter in it. So it's quite movable and squishy. Um, looks like a little, is that classed as a flange? I have no idea. Do I get to use the word flange finally? <laughs> is that a flanged edge? I don't know, but we'll put that to one side for a moment. Um, it's packed in polystyrene. There we go, you can see the, the imprints of that. And inside we have the complete device. Ooh. So let's move the box out of the way. Um, and then you can see that we have, it's all again bagged in like a um, cellophane type wrapper. Ooh, look at this. Oh wow, that is funky. Yeah. So if I remove, so it's, oh it's, um, it's, it's, it's cable. So it's not, I, and you can't take that out. So it is cabled. Um, which we'll have to test that out and yeah. see how that works. So the plug, obviously, that's a, a UK plug um, with a little fuse. So if it does blow, you can change the fuse. Um, let's just take a look at the, at the device. So you've got the word Jimmy there. Um, we'll try and take it apart <laughs> in a moment. I'm just saying if you can see the actual main cleaning head. So obviously there's like a little rubber or silicone um, spinner. The bristles feel quite nice and soft. Yeah, you should also be able to see on the bottom there, there's a hot air outlet on the bottom. Oh, which is there. here, and these are UV lights. Okay, so you can see what's going on. Yeah. Okay, that should be quite handy. What does it say here? Um, just says some of the information that I've just read from the box. Um, so there is a reminding sticker which says, turn off the machine before cleaning the brush roll. Do not apply UV function to people and animals. And the UV function may not work if sensor window is contaminated. Please turn off the machine and use a clean cloth to wipe. So 
Obviously, we don't need to make sure this is charged because we have a plug, so we can literally go straight into um, a pet demo. And we have left some areas of our house uh, hairy <laughs> from the cat fur. So we've got some cat beds we can try it on. We've got a duvet cover where the cat has been sleeping, Rory. Um, so we've got various areas that we can test this out on. So do you know how we get the... Is that just a spare filter, do you think? I don't know. Because if you look on the handle, we actually have a... A mode button that looks like on and off and we have a release so we try the release ah there we go uh -huh. so the con the canister or container comes off and looks like this do we uh, oh there's another does that release anything how do you get into this oh there you go oh yes yeah, so that's a spare one there we go because there's already one there so we have a spare so that's what the the head looks like so the, the flanged edge goes face down. So I'll remember to put that back. Um, oh, this all comes apart. So you've got oh, the, the canister. Um, it's known as a dust cup. So there we go. And there are some instructions for cleaning, but it just basically pulls apart. Um, there is a little filter. Yeah. I don't know. Anyway, it's all quite simple. So let's put this back together and I think we can go testing, can't we? So there we go. So it is really easy to put together. And that just kind of slips, fits on. There we go. Um, so on the actual um, brush head, you've got UV, tap and vacuum. So we'll see what they do when we turn it on. Okay, so here we are, it's plugged in. And actually the cable is quite long. If you look at where we plugged it in over there, uh, it's quite it a long quite cable, long. so, um, okay, where should we start? I'm going to start with, by the way, we have a bow here, so he's probably going to jump as soon as I turn it on. Yeah. Um, I'm not quite sure, what does UV do? Or do I have to turn it on? Turn first? it on first. Oh, there we go. Can you see them moving around? Yeah. Okay, let's just try. I can already see in the dust cup it's collected quite a bit. Yeah. Okay, oh, wow. so I just did a few swipes of this pet bed. You can see how much it's picked up. Yeah. So in wow. the canister, it has actually worked. Okay, so I think what we've discovered is that you have to use the mode button in on and off these lights here. So I think the UV is supposed to kill the mites. Ooh, that's so good. So you go over it with UV light and then it kills and sucks up. So it's kind of like cleansing with light. You've got three different modes. You've got UV, tap and vacuum. So UV is the UV light that will kill any bugs or mites or anything like that. Tap and tapping, it's the spinny bit here. So you can have that on or off if you want. So if you're going over something that's a bit delicate, like long thread carpet maybe, yeah. it won't pull up the threads, it will just suck and do the UV light, and then vacuum obviously is the, the okay. vacuum part of it. Uh, it's also got a sticker from the British Allergy Foundation, UK seal of approval, and on the canister it says, Ultra Silent Dual Cyclonic Removes Dust Mite Efficiently. Um, so there you go. Do you want to turn it on and demonstrate with pressing a different mode? Demonstrate on hard floor. Okay, this is a brand new duvet and um, one of our cats, Rory, has been sleeping here. So you can see the issue that we have and we're going to try and um, clean it with the jimmy.
so let's take a look. So I was quite impressed because it didn't pull the fabric. No. Which was really, really good. And as you can see, it's picked up. Pretty much everything. Yeah, that's how, I'm actually really impressed with that. Um, that's actually done very well. <laughs> yeah, and like I said, it didn't pull up the fabric or ruin a brand new duvet. Um, and it did what we wanted it to do. So I'm very impressed with how it handled that. And just look again at the canister. Um, it really is picking up all the bits. Mm. Shall we try it on the stairs where we know the cats have been sleeping? So we, we know our cats sleep here on the stairs. So let's just try it. You can see the cable is reaching as well. So let's try this. Um, yeah, again, it's the carpet feels really nice and smooth. No hairs, and any hairs that yeah. were here, I think, are now in the canister. Yeah, and this is quite oh, a yeah. deep pile as well, and yeah. it hasn't pulled up the threads at all. No, which is actually really handy. So I think this could also be good for cars uh, or vehicles because yeah. it's, it's small size. You would need an extension cable um, because it's not wireless, but... I think that would work very well on car seats or caravans oh, or or if you're going away on holiday and you're staying at an Airbnb or a cottage, a rental cottage, and you and it's pet friendly, you could take that along to suck up all the bits. Yeah. Very impressive. Yeah. Okay, so our overall feelings on the Jimmy. It's very impressive, actually. <laughs> yeah, for a very small, compact, handheld, wired device, it works really well. And I was very impressed especially on the duvet oh, yeah. and the pet bedding. And I just think it's very flexible um, and versatile for different usages around the home, car, caravan. If you're going on holiday in the UK, like a staycation, you want to yeah. take it with you. And I really like the UV filter. I mean, I'm trusting that it's working. <laughs> yeah. um, but I think it was really, really good to, ha to have a device that is centred around killing all those bugs and mites and things that our pets inevitably bring into our homes. Yeah. So um, I think Bo was quite impressed as well. He's just down yeah. there. We'll leave this linked in our description box. Do go and take a look. And obviously, up-to-date pricing will be there as well. Um, there may be some offers, so obviously go and take a look. So thank you for watching this video. If you've enjoyed it, please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to share it on social media. And do hit the bell so you know whenever we upload a new video. So from us, to you all, and goodbye. Bye.